Good morning, you ladies. My name is Jack Guy, and welcome to Kindergarten 2. It's finally out. We can finally play it. Thank God. I've been waiting so long for this, and everybody in the comments is always telling me, Jack, you need to play Kindergarten 2. It came out, and it didn't. It's only out now. I can only play it this time. I'm sorry. I'm getting very angry. What did you do to Nugget? My poor boy! It's the only reason I'm playing this game is because Nugget's the best boy in the whole world. Nugget is the best. I hope that he appears in this game quite a bit because I like doing this voice and it's one of my favorites and I want to do it a lot. There's just a straight up leg there. Um, but thank you to the developer for reaching out and giving me a code to this game. They're always super nice and I appreciate them a lot and I'm very excited to play this game. So let's get in to it. Right now? Tuesday? This doesn't start with Tuesday. It starts with Monday. Hey, it looks like this is a new save file. Be sure to check out the help section of this of the pause menu to run the controls and stuff. Will do. I full disclosure, I completely forget how to play this game. I don't know any of the buttons and I completely forget what any of the characters' voices sounded like, apart from Nugget, because he was the best. That's also where you can find the mission map. I'll tell you what story missions you can do with the stuff you've unlocked. Let me see it. Oh Jesus. The Hitman's bodyguard. <laughs> Flowers for Diana, A Tale of Two Genders. I get it. Okay, so they all kind of spill into each other? Okay, cool. Hopefully it's easier to follow along than Kindergarten 1, because Kindergarten 1's great, but a lot of what you have to do is like super trial and error, and it starts to get a little tedious day after day, and then you go in and it's like, oh shit, I passed that one sentence that I was supposed to do this thing in, and I have to restart the whole fucking day over again, so hopefully that's kind of gone. Okay, when you're ready to get started, head over to that door and we'll start our first day of school. Okay, I want to check out everything. What should I bring to school today? Okay, I don't have anything. Should I bring a one of them? Should I bring a shark? Should I bring a giant dildo? Who knows? Okay, these are all collectibles. I don't care about those. There's a button on my bedroom wall. I don't know what it does. Press the button! My wall farts. Nothing happened. Whatever it is, I must not be ready for it yet. Bummer. Is it going to open up a secret Dexter's laboratory? He's the smartest boy you've ever seen. With his sister Dee Dee, she's a bitch. She blows all his experiments to smithereens. Uh, outfits! What am I wearing today? I'm wearing generic man clothes. Okay, whatever. Let's just start the game. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? I sure am, buckaroo. Yay! All my favorites. Oh, look at no! Nugget's in the, in the fucking grate! Help! Nugget is trapped! <laughs> How did you get down there? You have 90 minutes? What do you want me to do about it? This is definitely not my problem. Nugget was searching for a suitable place for the new Nugget cave. So you crawl through a sewer grate? No. Nugget was searching for a suitable place to dig by the tree next to the handicap ramp. The ground started to shake. There was a cave in. You're handicapped? <laughs> okay, the tree next to the handicap ramp. Got it. People seem to think so. Right, so what should I do? Find help. Ask teacher, or janitor, or principal. Nugget does not care. Just to get Nugget out of here. Okay, okay. Do we have a new janitor? Or uh, not a new janitor, a new principal. Is that the lady up at the top? Because the last one, uh, tried to kill all the kids. Hey there, kiddo! I'm your friendly school janitor. Friendly? Yeah, I'd like to think so. You just let me know if you need any help getting adjusted here. I'm always happy to help. Can I get by here? Sorry, little buddy. Only kids with disabilities are allowed to use the handicap ramp on the side of the school. Okay, then. Um, I'm gonna have to give you all unique names. Well, some of you. Oh my god, you look like Tweak. This really is like South Park. The kind of scenarios that these characters get into. I forget what the janitor's voice was in Cindy's. I do remember... What was your name again? Oh, it's you! How's the- how's it going? Maybe it's stuck behind a sewer grate. Does he have any pills on him? I don't think so. Then he can stay down there! One less kid for me to worry about today! You're a peach. Hey, uh, you looking to buy something? Uh, you're still selling stuff? I forget all their names, I'm so sorry. <laughs> her name's probably not even Cindy. I think I was just calling her Cindy. Is it Cindy? Uh, what happened to you? Now, rotten janitor didn't like that I was uh, that I corrected his spelling, but it, rest assured, he's gonna get what's coming to him. Did the janitor break your legs? 
Again, I can't remember. I have a freaking beard hair in my mouth and I need to get it out. Are you going to kill Mr. Janitor? Kill him? Oh, no, 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 no. I'm going to destroy him. Um, okay. Monty! That was it. Monty was the guy who sells you stuff. Monty was the guy who kind of talked like this. You know, kind of had a Mac Wahlberg going on. Mac Wahlberg doesn't sound anything like that. But he was kind of from Boston, kind of a New York. I don't know where this accent is from. So you gonna buy something or what? What can I buy? What can I do for you? Uh, never mind. I don't want anything. Um, you're new. Hey, you must be one of the new kids. I'm Carla. Do you have any contraband on you? That's a strange question. Well, these are some strange times. I'm just trying to save you some study hall. No one gets in or out of here without with anything dangerous. They have a metal detector? Yeah, and her name is Penny. That blonde girl is the biggest snitch in school, and she has a knack for knowing who is carrying stuff. Is that the girl in the middle who looks like a fucking kettle? No idea. Oh wait, I didn't even check what the question was. Shit. No idea. But it's unwise to bring anything in these walls unless you have a special way of getting it in. Uh, your prison wallet? Well, if you want to get it past the living metal detector over there, I can offer you my services for a small fee. Sure. What do you want smuggled in? Actually, never mind. I have to figure out how the game works first. Hello! My name is Penny. My mommy is the principal. You must be one of the new kids. It's so nice to meet you. Wanna be friends? I would love to be friends. Here, you can have this friendship bracelet. Okay, maybe not yet. No thanks. Oh. That's too bad. Let me know if you change your mind. She kind of reminds me of, um... What's the doll's name in the new Toy Story? The one with the Vincents. Who's trying to get the, the voice box out of Woody. She's just so nice. But so sinister. Cindy! This new school is so much more my style. Especially the new selection of boys. What do you think? I thought we were together. <laughs> Sorry, honey, but you're, we're yesterday's news. Besides, we both know I'm too good for you anyway. Ouch. <laughs> Here's the tissue! Cry me a river! Now will you help me get a new boyfriend? I have better things to do. Filthy! Absolutely filthy! What is? You blind? Look at this place! That no- that other no-name janitor over there has really let us- let this place go to crap. You don't know his name yet? What? No! But I guess I should learn it. If I'm gonna draw up a kid, we'll find out his name for me now. If I'm gonna draw up a kid- okay, jeez. Um, yeah, these guys read it last time. You took my knife, the little snitch. She's made a very unstable enemy. I'm gonna make you Patrick Starr from Spongebob. <laughs> what are you talking about? The stupid principal's daughter. She knew- she somehow knew I had an army and now I have to- I have to study all. This new school is so stupid. Maybe I can help. Have you ever had something dangerously- dangerous wrongfully taken from you? I can't speak. Um, not exactly. Then you wouldn't understand. I'm gonna pack myself. Yeah, good luck with that. Um, wait, can I talk to you about getting nugget out? Okay, I'll we'll find out his name. -la 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 -la. Hello again, little buddy. What's going on? What's your name? Oh, how rude of me. I'm Bob. Most of the kids around here just refer to me as the janitor anyway. You can call me that too if you like. Uh, stop talking to Bob. No. Oh yeah, stop talking to Bob. Because he only wants me to get by there. Um, I'm gonna need like a character sheet. I need a character sheet to remember who does what, what their names are, what they sound like, and their motivations. We need to characterize! We need theatrics! We need drama! Oh, Mr. Janitor! What's his name? Come on, I got a declaration to draw up. It's Bob. So, my nemesis has a name. Bob. What, what are you gonna do to him? What the janitor code, janitor's code of honor says I should do. Which is? I'm gonna kill him and take his mop, duh! What do you think I was gonna do? Make friends? Have dinner? Go out with him? Treat his wife nicely? No! I'm gonna fucking kill him and take his wife. 
Seriously? You bet. Take this declaration of war and bring it to Bob. Return to me when it's done. This will be one of one for the history books. I guess it will be. Oh no, Monty, what are you doing? Monty's disabled. Monty can do what he wants. Ah, got it. Okay, um... I'm already, like, starting off the episode. I haven't even got into school for the day to start yet, and I'm already trying to kill people. That sure is kindergarten, baby. Hello again. I want him to be like a, a Minnesotan. Like, hello again, little buddy. No, that's not a Minnesota accent. It's like, ah, oh, heck. Oh, gosh. What the hell do you think you're doing there? Hello again, little buddy. What's going on? Okay, that's his voice. We're going to stick with that. The other janitor wanted me to give you this. Oh, thanks. I'll read it when I get inside. Go ahead and tell him you delivered it. I'm really looking forward to working with him. I doubt that. School time! That's the bell! Everybody inside! It's school time! That's the bell! Everybody head inside to your assigned classrooms! Okay, is that the new principal? Missy Pal? Okay, kids! Teacher has a headache, so we're going to be very quiet. It looks like this school has more funding than the last one, since there are actually toys. Go play! Just be quiet! Yay! Playtime! I want to play with a knife! Oh yeah, now I'm, now I'm remembering how the game works. So you have an apple per scenario. Like, you have a certain amount of apples per scenario. So you have to get all your apples and all your ducks in a row before you can move on and do the next phase. So if you mess up one of your apples and use it in the wrong place, then... <laughs> shit out of luck. Ugh! What do you... What do you want? Never mind. What do you want? I'm busy trying to figure out how to get my knife back. Probably better if he doesn't have it. So I'm trying to figure out why certain... Certain apples then have faces on them in the bottom right. So does that mean that certain scenarios... Like it's telling me what missions I can do. How do I access my missions? Monster Mon. Oh yeah, the cards. Um... I- ah, oh god. I already forget how to- Mission map. There we go. Tale of two janitors. So I guess I'm doing this one. I've kind of started this one off. Start the mission by talking to the janitor. Okay. And then start the mission by talking to Dr. Danner. Okay. And start the mission by talking to Felix and then Ted. Okay, I didn't talk to any of those guys. Alright, janitor it is. Destruction! was the best toy in the toy box! My friends and I used to play with him all the time before you you new kids came in! Was the best toy? His name's Ozzy. Yeah, but now he's out of battery! No friends, no toys! You new kids are the worst! I don't care, Ozzy. I just love this doll. She's so pretty, just like me. That's great, Cindy. Her name is Cindy. Are my headphones on? It was acting a little weird. Sorry, you guys couldn't hear that. When I have to click it, it's like, battery, about 70%. So I have to wait because there's no audio between them. My dad drives a car like this. He said that when he dies, my twin brother Felix gets to have it. It's sad, Ted. Oh, a Monster Bond card. Hey! I know I, li I look like death right now, but my eyes still work. Who goes through other people's cubbies? There's some toys in here. But only the spinny fidgeter looks interesting. Oh god, Nugget! Oh god! <laughs> Nugget is present! Oh wait, he capped up his arm. His other arm. Nugget is present! Nugget, what happened? My poor boy! <laughs> My sweet little man! My favorite character! No! Nugget is late! So you're getting studio- Oh dear god! What happened to your arm? Nugget had to chew it off in order to escape from the failed Nugget cave. <laughs> <laughs> Nugget, you're the fucking best! Why did you- oh, Never mind! Do you want to go to the nurse? You're bleeding all over the new classroom! Nugget is quite durable. Nugget will survive. <laughs> Nugget is indestructible. Nugget knows how the human body works. I still have several other bones that are functioning. If you insist, go ahead and play. Or do whatever it is that you do. There are no toys left for the poor Nugget. This makes Nugget sad. Blood everywhere. Oh my god. <laughs> Can I give him the fidgety spinner? No toys. No arm. Nugget is having a bad day at school. <laughs> no toys. No arm. Nugget is having a bad day at the new school. I have a toy for you. 
Not gonna appreciate the generosity. Not gonna reciprocate with a Boston Bog card. Cool. Thanks. Oh, he only has one hand to play with the fidget spinner. Nugget, you poor boy! It's so sad! Okay, what what do we do now? Nugget likes the fidgety spitty. I'm your arm. Nugget chewed it off like a trapped coyote to help him escape. Have you ever seen the movie 127 Hours? Just call me James Franco from now on. Your arm was stuck? No, Nugget just thought it was necessary. <laughs> wasn't even stuck at anything. He just chewed it off because he thought he had to. <laughs> I just love this doll. I just can't do anything else. There's some toys in here, but none of them look useful. Don't take anything. Okay, I don't think I can do much more right now. Can I leave? Hey! You can't leave! I'm responsible for you little monsters! We can use the bathroom. Well, too bad! I don't have a bathroom pass for this new school yet. You'll just have to hold it! You don't look like you can stop me. I can still give you a study hall! Apparently that's the punishment for stuff here! Hmm. Okay. So, should I go to... study hall? Why not? No, oh, no, look at this shifty-eyed motherfucker. Hi! Hold up, new kid. You're only allowed to use the bathroom, nothing else. So I'm allowed out without a pass? Only until we can distribute pass books to you new kids. Now that you go to the bathroom, or you go back to class. Passbook? We use pass books instead of traditional passes here, unless it's a special occasion. They'll be distributed soon. Here's the info. Now stop dawdling and back to class. I'll go back to class. I'm gonna pee my brains out. What's the janitor? Tell me, boy. What is war? War has changed. So people fight. That's right. Well, people can't fight if declarations of war are delivered. Oh. So we're gonna fight instead. Tough luck, kid. I don't want you. Oh! Jesus fucking Christ! Yep! You should have delivered the declaration. I thought I did! Anything else in the bathroom that I can do? See, I don't even have the declaration of war anymore. All I have is my own stuff. What, uh, can I see what items I have? Should I use the stall? Yes. Sweet! Yep, those are urinals. Okay, I'm not gonna talk to him again because he's gonna kill me. Later, Tater! Uh, I'll have to talk to you again. Just to get the passbook info, even though that's probably not that important. Alright, so I'm probably gonna get study hall then after this. How is it that I just ended the day? Oh, I press enter and I can use up all my apples. Ah. Attention, new kids! Here's your passbook. If you get an adult to sign it, you're allowed out in the halls. Don't get any crazy ideas, though. You're only allowed to use it once per day. Okay. If I get an adult to sign it, I don't have parents. I'm an orphan in this game. Oh, thank God! That's the bell! Get out of my classroom, we're gonna lunch! Okay. Whatever. Alrighty, what can we do? The lunch lady! She's back! <laughs> Nugget's still trailing blood everywhere. Nugget is getting quite woozy. Nugget misses his arm. I don't want to talk to Nugget anymore. I do! Felix says I'm not allowed to talk to anyone unless it's about business, sorry. Go away, you vagabond. We're talking about business. You wouldn't understand. Okay. Come see me at recess, kid. I'm in the middle of a very lucrative deal. Okay. I just love making new friends. It is so, it still seems too thrilled to meet you. That was a sentence and a half. Okay. Hey, new kid. How are you liking the food? It's fine. I can't believe none of the new boys want to sit with me. I'm still stuck hanging out with these two losers. Good luck, Cindy. Burgers are okay, but I actually kind of missed the slop. Me too. Oh, his name is Bugs? Yeah. New school, same kids to sit with. What's the point of all this anyway? I don't know, Jerome. It's a condiment station. The school has everything. Walk away. Cool. 
This is a caution sign. I can't read it, but I assume it's a warning not to slip on this puddle. You don't have to read the caution sign. You can just see what's on it. Hello, child. What would you like for lunch? Hamburger. I want hamburger. Me want big food. There you are, child. One burger. Please enjoy. I forget your voice as well. I'm gonna have to look them all up afterwards to come back next time. Um, so I can do stuff with the janitor. I'm probably gonna get killed if I talk to him. Yes, kid, believe it or not, I do occasionally do my job. Good for you. Okay, let's make sure we've exhausted everything. No kids allowed in the teacher's lounge. Go find- go finish your lunch, kid. I need to get in there. I don't care what you need. I'm not moving unless there's a monitoring emergency. Monitoring emergency? Yes! A monitoring emergency. I deal with them on a daily basis. You never know when delinquency or tardiness will strike. Okay, he's a shifty I do. He just sits there and he monitors the hall. He knows what's going on, but he's too scared to talk about it. <laughs> okay, do you want to be? Do you want to be? Do you want to be boyfriend, girlfriend, Cindy, Ozzy? Um, how do I use my items? I think I can. Does anybody- anybody want my hamburger? Oh wait! Bugs wants my hamburger, right? Oh no, he misses the slop. Can I put the condiments on my hamburger? I don't know anymore, okay? Everybody's eating burgers. Do you want- do you want a burger? Anybody want my burger? Nugget, do you want a burger? Okay, I can't talk to you because it's about business. Okay. Fine. Oh, Jander's doing something. Sweet! Okay, I can't go in there. It's there! The floor is dry! What more could they possibly want from me? Good point. Ah, okay. So each apple with the face triggers the next thing for them. Okay. What are you doing? You cannot leave? You have not eaten yet! I bought a burger. Oh! My mistake. Please allow me to mark your passbook. Oh, okay. There you are! Thank you for buying lunch today! Thank you! You're welcome! Oh, he's gonna the peapot. Hey, it's Stoner Man! Hey, man! You need a pass to be out here. Go back to lunch or I'm giving you study hall. I have one. Oh! A bathroom pass. Okay, go ahead. <laughs> Thank you. Ozzy? Ozzy Mandias, are you in here? Uh, hey! Is anyone out there? I need some toilet paper. There isn't any in here. Wait, I have a tissue. I can give him tissue. No, don't leave him sitting in there with a poopy butt. This is the door to the janitor's closet. It's locked. Dang it. Okay, so I need to come in here to do something with him. There are a couple of spiders on the wall. I'm not touching them unless I can spray them with something first. Okay, we're getting we're getting a lot of good intel. <laughs> Fucking Nugget's blood trail. <laughs> Can I leave? I want to go home. I hate this. Can I use the elevator? The elevator requires a key to operate. Alrighty. Good to know. Alright, lunch lady's going to do something. Oh yeah. End lunch time. That's what she's got. Bell is wrong. Be gone from my cafeteria. Be gone, thought! Anyone who has disobeyed our lovely principal today shall report to study hall. All oh, others may go to play at recess. Shit. Me been having study hall. Well, well, well. Look at all the bad children. I expect you all to behave until recess is over. Please take this time to reflect on how to be less awful in the future. There is to be no more talking or moving until the bell rings. Is that clear? Sorry, I saw crystal clear. I said no talking. Ho 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 ho! Oh, ho ho ho! I got shot in the fucking eyeball! Okay! Shit! <laughs> I got shot in the head again! God damn it. Okay. Clever bunch. We'll see if it lasts. Why do all the teachers want to kill us? Ugh. The coffee I had during lunch is running right through me. I'll be back in a moment. Do not move or talk while I'm gone. Okay, you fucking lunatic. 
<laughs> Immediately moves. Stupid study hall. First to take my knife, then I take my freedom. That sucks, Bugs. Bugs is that kid where it's like, Bugs, what do you have? A knife. No! <laughs> Bugs just wants to watch the world burn. This is Ted. This is Ted's cubby. There's three dollars in here. Take the money. There are a couple of toys in here. There's a doll and a toy car. Okay, can I take both? Damn it. Okay, I can't. There's empty cubbies. All right, so there's a couple of things I can do in here. I I should be in the exact same place, or he's going to be fucking mad. My apologies. Good to see you're all behaving. Yay! Ah, there's the bell. Anyone who pays their lab fee can come with me to science. Otherwise, head over to the gym. Go to science? Or go to the gym? I kind of want to go to the gym and get swole. Ah, uh, but I did steal money, so... Ah! Uh, <laughs> Let's go to the gym! Let's get fucking buff! Oh god! Ah, oh, I don't want to see that! Ew! Oh, my life is ruined! It can't actually get worse! So, what are we doing here? Trying your best! Not to look like me in 30 years! Really? I think it's a lot longer than that. Go run laps or bust an orange ball or something! I guess we can do that. I'm gonna go stand over there and try to keep the room from spinning! It's, I'm exhausted! I shouldn't have had that many mimosas for breakfast! Alrighty. Only water? I wish they would let us have soda. <laughs> Might as well just fucking kill me now. Oh, bugger off. I'm playing catch with my brother. Oh, come on, Felix. You can play with us. Not a chance now. Go away. God. Birds of a feather are dicks together. Let go. I want to shoot some free throws. Get in line, you kid. This basketball is mine. Oh, shit. I don't even know what I did. I was pressing space to move the dialogue along. Oof! <laughs> Big oof! You hit me in my face! Minecraft damage sound! Okay, who did it? Who threw that ball? It is this Jerome kid. He tried to take the ball from me, and when I tried to get it back, he just threw it in your direction. What? That's a lie! This kid came over and helped her snatch it out of my hands. It went flying over when they made me let go. Both of you shut up! What really happened? Okay, I can't pick the other one, so Carla is telling the truth, I guess. That's what I thought, Jerome, you little lying shit! Do you know how bad my head hurts right now? It was already spinning! It actually kind of stopped for a second when it hit me, and now it's spinning twice as fast! Not more than that waistband on those shorts, I'm guessing. Jerome! Oh! Oh, shit! Love him or hate him, Jerome's spitting straight facts right now. Okay, now I'm mad! Ow! Hey, stop! Screw this, I'm out of here. She's beating the shit out of the kid. Come back here, this is making me feel better. <laughs> Hell yeah. Good work, kid. I appreciate the help. You think fast on your feet. No problem. Nugget is having trouble enjoying gym today. <laughs> Why is that? Oh, I don't know. Maybe because I'm missing half of my arm appendages. Nugget's arm is missing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Nugget's arm is missing. Okay. Can I talk to you again? Nope. Talk to Ball? Nope. Okay, can I leave? Oh, hell yeah! Yes, I can! Yes, I Canada. Shit. Sorry, bro. You're supposed to stay in gym, head back down. Oh, man. Yoo-hoo! Anybody in here? I have a burger, a tissue, and a car. Who wants to trade? Oh, it's open. Oh. Oh! Oh! Is this the septic room? Weapons! These weapons are way too big for me to carry. The axe looks like it's been used recently. Leave the weapons alone. That is the worst sentence anyone has ever said in kindergarten. Leave the weapons alone. I live for the weapons! There's a chainsaw and a shovel on this shelf. I'm gonna take a chainsaw. It's getting really hard to breathe in here. I'm not sure how much longer I can last. Oh shit, one more action is death. This is the janitor's cleaning card. It looks like there's a monster bond card inside the waste bag. Sweet! Uh, something smell- What voice did I give him? Something smells funny. <laughs> Leave Bob alone. Poor Bob, he's gonna die. 
Is that a reference to Stranger Things? Bob? Everyone love Bob? Oh, shit! She straight up killed him! I witnessed this! Uh, uh, he was much faster than I thought! Walked up a sweat, smacking him around! You killed Jerome! Yes! Uh, and I feel better! And tired! Oh, let me just have a drink! No wonder the janitor likes hitting you kids! I'm just gonna leave you there! Oh, that was me. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Like her or hate her, she's hitting straight kids. <laughs> okay, I can't go out. Alright, well, I witnessed something that my baby eyes should not have witnessed. So let's, uh, let's just speed this along. <laughs> okay, I can't... Skip. It's not moving, it's frozen. Is something supposed to happen? I think I broke the game. Oh thank god, the day is finally over! Get out of my sight, all of you! No! Go home. Oh, that principal is creepy. I bet that she wants to kill all the kids as well. Oh, Nugget! No! <laughs> Day complete! New Mastermon unlocked. Yay, book of water, bucket of water and hallowed night. First day of school. Why is it always a Tuesday? Game's blowing up! On a Tuesday! Deal 2 damage plus 2 damage if your last discarded card is blue. Reduce a red Monster Mons. Can we actually play Monster Mon? It would be so awesome if there was a fully fledged, like, card game in the game. <gasps> there is! I can make a deck! Hell yeah! Does this button do anything yet? No. Okay! Well, I'm gonna leave this episode here. We didn't actually get anything from here, but that's just the way kindergarten goes. There's a lot of trial and error to go on. So, as we progress through this, we'll figure out what scenarios we can do and what to focus in on. Because the idea is that you start off a day, you pick one mission to go for. You only have enough apples usually to do one mission, and you pick that one and progress that one until the end. If you try and do two missions at once, usually it doesn't work. Maybe this one is different, I don't know, but that's usually how the first kindergarten worked, and you kind of have to be careful about what you're doing. So, let's figure this out together in the next episode. I'd love to hear your thoughts, your tips, what missions should we do? I don't know what ones to do first, but I am very excited that kindergarten is bad. I am so excited that Nugget's back. The game is just going to be called Nugget Garden from now on. Kinder Nugget! That's all that I care about. Anything else, whatever. Other characters, fine. Story. Plot. Things will happen. But as long as Nugget's in the game, my face will be smiling. But for now, I'm gonna leave it here! Just remember, don't smack your kids! I, I don't know why I would need to clarify why, just don't smack them. Oh thank god, kindergarten is back!